125 big blinds. Uh, it was always going to happen. It was just always, always, always going to happen. Let's go world champion weekend. Hopefully. Would be a pretty cool tournament to run well in. We also have a monster stack in that, uh, in that 1k now. Winner says good luck today, Finty. Thank you. And we're going to play our first pot in the $10,000 Thursday Trill. I would like to remind everybody that we did win the $5,000 Thursday Trill on the last Thursday of Scoop. And we are getting re-raised by KZH. What else would we expect? Let's go World Champion this weekend. Don't worry about it. If you posted it twice, don't sweat it. Uh, King Queen off is one of the few hands that is off suit that we will call in these positions. And we will just check fold. Man, the structure is very quick. This is the exact same as the 10k, sorry, the 25k, where it's just madness. It is just a madness. On a tough table, we're not opening fours here. I mean, if it was a softer table, sure, but it's not. We have been moved table over here. Are we going to get more players or we're just going to be playing four max down here? They're just always all in, aren't they? Like, they're just always all in. I am a complete and utter genius. We are going to mix between re-raise and call here. This time we are going to call. I have a tree bet if I was suited. This is why I tend to lean towards tree bet in these spots. Just plus KZHH. It's not going to be easy. Very good player and very annoying to play against. I think he won the 25k and the 10k recently. So our task is just to run good in one tournament. Like we did during scoop. Just, just, just sun run it. It's not a lot to ask for poker stars, just one tournament. It's gonna get nice and interesting, couldn't it? I think with the backdoor straight draw and the backdoor flush draw, even against half pot, I can't fold them. This is fun, isn't it? This is just so much fun. I love playing 10Ks. Playing 10Ks is so much fun. Playing 10Ks is so much fun. I don't think I'm allowed to fold, but I really fucking want to. <sighs> Let's go, give me some chips. Give me some chips. I would have been, uh, I would have honestly preferred calling if they shoved. It freaked me out a little bit that they didn't bet it all in. But uh, good start to 10k, sit up there. Don't worry about it, mate. Don't worry about it too much. I think it's a pretty good bluff. I mean, just because it blocks a7 and a10 of Harris, which would be two of the best aces that we're going to float the flop with. But uh, luckily for me, I am a station and I will never fold. And over here, we are, uh, we had a good start. It's already gone better than when we played the 25k, where we never got above starting stack once. Good banish for an $11 tournament. Have I got the wrong title on it? Whoops. Whoops, 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 whoops. My bad. Whoops, 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 Sorted. My bad. Unprofessional. At the highest. That was so disrespectful with the 10-7. I think it's... I think it's... It blocks the... Ace 10 and Ace 7 of hearts, like I said, that are likely to float the flop, so. I would suspect that is why that hand was used. Finty on fire with the calls. I'm never folding to anyone. It's the last week of WQ if everybody's punting. Nobody bluffs for the first two weeks of WQ, but then everybody bluffs. And that is quite simply a fact. The beautiful thing about running well or making a big call early doors is first off, there's now a player who's kind of sure on the table. But on top of that, if we knock anyone out, we cover them for the bounty, and that is huge. Because that's a $2,500 bounty, and I paid $0 into this tournament, so if I win a $2,500 bounty, that is just cash monies. All the best today, Finty. Hope you run better than your horse's namesake. Rough you and that. Had to back it, though. I gave it my best, mate. I might have punted off a few quid from my community, but we were just having a bit of crack, weren't we? I'll raise my 6-5. Might be a little wide, but we're playing 700 right now. So I will treat myself... And we're going to try and treat ourselves to a sexy little two pairs on the flop. Take that $2,500 bounty. Have a bit of crack. Not far off. Uh, I think i got to run this with the bounty, don't I? All right. We do not get called for the bounty, but we do win a very nice pot. We will take it. Got Small the Hero on our left, who has always caused me trouble as well. We've already had 40 entrants. 750k guarantee. I feel like it's going to absolutely smash through it. And what's against Sprague, we're going to mix between call and retrieve it. This time we're going to be re-raising. How about the donkey, mate? How about the donkey, pal? We have queens in the 10k. This is an official announcement that I have queens. Finton, I like your trophy graph. Is it from the Poker Tracker full version? Uh, do you mean this thing? I got this commissioned by an artist, so I'm afraid. Uh, I asked her how she felt about giving it away for free, and it was a it was a firm no. So I'm afraid I can't share it. Marcus says, "Let's go. I'll sell it for one soul." And in the 10k, I'm gonna raise it up with Ace Deuce, and I'm going for an aggressive check fold. 
All right, boys and girls, it is early doors, but we've had an okay start in the 10k. And in the 10k, we flat out with Ace Jack. I'm not sure if their size is a team, but here we are. Interesting turn cards. Very, very interesting turn cards. I am fucking petrified. I am extremely scared. Obviously, we're not folding, but this is naughty. I just have king 10 every time. Can ace 4? No, not really. Did I just have king 10 every time? Like, what else did I bluff with? King X of hearts, king X of spades. Just don't think they can bluff here very easily. I mean, maybe, possibly, they go with king 9 of hearts, but it seems a little unlikely to me. You can probably bet big here with some hands, but we're not going to do it with this hand. Could overbet the turn potentially, but just gotta go for this size. Alright, let's just win a few flips and get a few baddies down here, shall we? You think I'm afraid to open King 7 against Naza and Pivagar? <laughs> Cause I am not <laughs> I don't really want to get check raised, I'm just gonna tell the truth right now. We are gonna check the turn. Alright, we are gonna have to call the river here. Unfortunate pot. We are back down to starting stack. Kind of full top pair here. I would have raised this one if it falls to me, but not to be. Whew, I am sweltering. Time to put the AirPods in. Absolutely sweating. Now we're out. We're out. Here we're going to mix between call and re-raise. This time we're going to re-raise. And over here we are going to continue. And hope that they just failed. Thank you. Uh, we're going to bluff here. In the 10k. And we're gonna have to bet on this board. <clears throat> I'll show you me five of hearts, Lex. I nearly choked on my Viennese whirl. I'm ready to play for all the chips. Tonka trying to ship the 5k? Madness. Tonka on a final table. I'm trying to win it. Do we risk the call? Surely someone would squeeze. Oh, I'm not fucking risking that. I'm raising. I'm eating a Viennese whirl and re raising in the 10k with aces. My life probably will never get better in this moment right now. I fucking hope Hannah's not watching. What about when we have kids and get married? Fair. Alright, this is pocket 10s. And they're out. There's no way it's pocket 7s. It's pocket 10s all day long. Pocket 10s! For $2,500, you have pocket 10s! For $2,500! Sad. <clears throat> uh, we're gonna check. I can raise here sometimes, so we're gonna check this time. Uh, if M. Arthur bets, we will be calling. Very good chance that our queen high is good. Got back to our flush draw. Just overall not ready to fold right now. And on this turn card, I will fold. It is all yours. We pick up Ace King in the 10k on the Bhutan. That was a good hand to have. We're gonna re-raise versus Oman for rolls, and if they shove, we are playing a monster pot for a $2,500 bounty. And on Jack 5-6, we are gonna start by betting flop. Put it out of Benny Butter 215, unfortunately. Uh, we are not going to be full in versus this size. It is a little bit annoying because Ace Jack is the most likely hand, and King Jack, which both dominate me, but we're not ready to fold just yet. On this turn card, if they have King Jack, pocket sixes, we get stacked. That is unfortunately just how this game works. <clears throat> I'd shove this turn with Ace Queen, I'd shove this turn with some backdoor spades. Mm, maybe we actually bet small. Maybe we actually just bet small. If they have a set here, we're getting stacked. Alright, nice. Up to 350,000 chips. Of course, would have preferred if they had had it, but such is life. We are going to raise with the ace jack. Uh, we're going to start with a check in the 10k on 1095. And I don't love it, but I will be calling versus this bet from Lex. I dominate all of his bluffs, so I'm not prepared to fold it just yet. Obviously, sometimes we're in shocking shape, like he can have like ace-10, he can have pocket 10s, pocket 9s, but not ready to fold just yet. Not going to be calling ace shock in a turn. I will value at the river, though. I think Lex has a decent amount of king-jack. 
has a decent amount of queen jack. If he raises, we'll just fold. If he finds a bluff, congratulations. Don't really want to be raised, but I'm just going to fold if we are, so it doesn't really matter. And I think if Lex calls, we always win. Unless like he makes a really, really tight call, like 7-8, but it seems unlikely. <clears throat> I'm a little bit surprised that he decided to just call that hand. But I, 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 I was going to fold this hand, so. We are having a re-raise. Thanks for the thoughts. Finton was just curious. Appreciate the thoughtful process. No probs. Obviously, if Lex has aces or kings, then such is life. <clears throat> All right, we get the chips that we lost off them. <laughs> the fucking donkey, man. The donkey might be the most insulting one, and I love it. Um, actually, gonna call this time. This has gone very, very well. Well, <laughs> honestly, it's kind of tempting to check, but we're gonna bet this size. Cool. Very cool stuff. He was afraid of jacks. That's fair. I mean, I was gonna bet all this jack, right? So. And we have ace queen. Hopefully, we see the shove from Blanco. I would still call versus the shove from Omar for rolls. A little bit less keen on it, but for 100,000 chips for a $2,500 bounty in the $10,000 buy in. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't get to play for $2,500 bounties as a starting bounty very often, so let's win it. Oh my god, we're ahead. Don't you dare. Uh, seems a little bit wide, given that they don't have as much fold equity, but they paid their $10,000 and they're a lot better than me at poker, so congratulations to them. Didn't want a $2,500 bounty and 200,000 chips. Why would I want 100 big blinds right now? It's too many chips, I don't know how to do it. Has always gambled on his friends. It's always just been an all round top lad. Give me another shot at the bounty there, will you? Go on, go on, Blanco. Shove, MacArthur. Shove, shove all the chips. The Kevin Cleans won't let me down. It's for fucking seven and a half thousand dollars. Seven and a half thousand dollars with the Kings. Seven and a half thousand dollars, Kevin. Hold. Please hold. Please hold. Seven and a half thousand dollars from Kevin! That emote is never getting banned for us! Whew! See, we don't mount it in with the ace queen and we get rewarded. Good buzz. We'll take it. Did, did you hear me right there? Seven and a half thousand dollars. Just <laughs> dropped in your account, just like that. Cash money dollar bills, yo! That horse is good luck, have fun. Thank you. You think it was team play? You think that I you think I was willing to put in all those chips with the ace jack? Do report it, please do. I feel like you murder the keyboard every time you type. I don't even type that hard, I don't think. It's just like the proximity of the keyboard, like the keyboard's right beside the microphone. Um, all right, then we have Ace Queen on the Bhutan. We're just gonna call. Going to flop top pair. Going to start with a bet. If we get check raised, we shall see a turn. And obviously now we are just going to empty the clip. <clears throat> Ace nine for the coolers. Not this time. Man, we are running a little bit hot with the hands we were picking up, eh? How far are we into the stream? Six and a half hours. If Naza re raises me, I will just be shoving it in his face. Same treatment for Arthur. Bowies, innit? I like big booties and I cannot lie. Alright, versus the end of the gun, we will have some respect for Mr. Belthouse and we will just fold. Uh, we are gonna race. Oh, you are you're all moaning about the four. You don't even know that the Kevin Cleans have won me seven and a half grand. Ah, the four's been hot all day, haven't they? Perhaps says you can't have them running better. Seems unfair. It does a little bit, doesn't it? Uh, I'm going to continue, even though I think this is a reasonably good board. I also think they're going to have aces sometimes. But we're just going to bet. If they raise, I'll just fold. Good looking at 10k. Thank you, mate. Obviously, very, very sad if they shove over my turn bet, which they might. Ah, I fucked up, didn't I? Oh, I really fucked up. So we have nine outs once, which needs four to one, but if we include the bounty, it's gonna hit it, so. We can't hit it. <clears throat> they do have the aces. <sighs> okay. We did suspect they might have the aces, and ladies and gentlemen, lo and behold, they had the aces. To be free round the tournament, we needed a spade, we didn't find it. $7,500, it's like winning the bounty builder 215 earlier on, or $7,500 refers. 
Is not not a bit mad? Naza survives. I mean, a stack on the relatively short side and shortening MacArthur is not the worst thing that could happen. We're gonna raise with seven six of diamonds. Why small screen? Please bigger. I look on Foon. Just for the break. All right, flop me pretty. Flop me blue. Flop me six. And flop me seven. It's gonna be enough to roll with it. Oh, they have nines. Terrible news. Terrible, terrible news. Damn it. Damn it! Nines is the worst time we could have seen, obviously. <laughs> ah. It's a big pot. A very, very big pot indeed. Just another $2,500 bounty pot and also 80 big blinds. Where's the justice? How do we not get them back after days four? We are seven hours into the stream, not gonna lie. Stars put me in a 10k, gave me a little bit of energy. Maybe it was the 10 hours I slept last night as well, I'm not sure. I think with 200 cards we fold, even with a backdoor flush draw, it's very close though. All right, blinds are up. It is a very, very quick structure, which it tends to be in these higher stake tournaments. The lads don't want to be playing poker all day, even if it's for $10,000. They're like, nah, we're good. Uh, this is gonna be shove against Lex, obviously. If he calls, it's probably not gonna be great news, but. I mean, Lex is not... Of the players on this table, if I'm going to put out bad beats, I don't want it to be on Lex, but it's just as a shove in a bounty tournament. And I am going to do a bluff. Do a little bluff. Against Mexican 2-2-2. Two, two, two. We got four bet, we're just folding. Obviously, they're incentivized to put a lot of chips in because my booty's getting big. Um, um, a five or nine gives me a straight... How many bigs do I have? Is it too many to just put in on this board? I think if it was 8, 6, deuce, we would want to... Actually, then I wouldn't have the double gutter, so never mind. Not a great turn. We are going to have to call. We have a straight draw to go along with our pair, just not folding yet. Wow, this is fucked. Ooh. I block 10, 9. I block 9, 7. I block the boats. God, I'm going to have to hear a call. I need value bets. I just don't believe that they find a check with a hand that's better than mine here. <laughs> Big boy pots. Very, very thin on that river. Let me tell you that, boys and girls. Good luck, Fintan. Thank you, mate. Appreciate it. $250 in bounties in the 1k. Feels like pennies. How, how silly. A $1,000 bounty is bigger than the starting bounty than we ever play. We're usually playing 530 max during a series. I get a $250 bounty over there and I don't even blink. Sorry. Crazy in-law stories, we'll need to wait. Naza, the water's warm. Please dip a toe. Come on, it's safe over here. It's real safe. I promise, I'd never lie. I'm a good, good in Check race. No. <sighs> Longboat, you feel free to share whatever you want in here. This is a safe space where we look after one another. And uh, I'm glad that you feel that you can uh, have a little vent. Naza. Naza! Naza! Uh, it's a good flop. Chat, I'm kind of tempted to just shove because I don't think people bet full this size. They're just not bet folding, are they? Like, they're just bet calling. Let's avoid the 10 or the 9 for loads of chips, please! Whoop whoop! It's more bounties! Let's go! Give me all them chips! Good one, the lads! Ah, oh, who's the booty daddy? Who's the booty daddy? Give me them chips. 100 big blinds as well. Not mad at it. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. $10,000 in bounties. All right, we've ace king. We are getting a lot of good hands here, boys and girls. Does anybody want me to teach them to dance? I will teach you to dance. Do you want me to teach you to dance? I will teach you to dance. I will teach you to dance. Please go all in. Please let me get them. Please let me get them. I will teach you both to dance. Avoid the 10. I'm already the booty daddy. Make my booty even bigger. All right. Stephen Tracy's right. It's been too long. Go on then. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, 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 all
We have a million chips, which means we have four starting stacks and we have twelve and a half thousand dollars in booties. All right, all right, all right. Back to the 10k. We're having a bit of crack. Turn the music down a little bit. Turn it down. These spots are insane. They are indeed. What's up top in the 10k? Uh, it's hard to say until it's over, but at the moment it will be about two hundred thousand dollars, and it'll depend on how many bounties you take. Findel, I'm traveling to Pokerstar Sunday for my wife's birthday. Can you get me tickets to the 25k? Uh, there's actually no 25k this Sunday, or I would. Sorry about that, mate. If you had asked for the 5k, I would have got it. Yes. Did Poker Stars buy me in? Yes, they did. <sighs> Is it time to dance? It might be time to dance. All right. Well, we're gonna be check raise getting this in for bounties in the ten thousand dollar for absolute chunks as well. If there was not bounties, I would check all here a lot of time. But ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> there is bounties. We might have to play teach you to dance if we win this bounty and all those chips. Uh, we're going to check the turn. Got a sub coming in from Finn. Thank you very much. Hopefully they check Ace Queen with the Queen of Spades. So much promise. I think we might have got saved, boys and girls. They are all in on the river. Obviously we're folding. We got the fold over here as well. Take it. 7 out of 46. Man, these tournaments are absolutely next level intense. Out of control, carry on. Uh, we're going to be all in. We I would have shoved here, so maybe save me a few chips against Omaha for rolls. Uh, we are raising in the 10k, which is going to take a preference. If Naza was to shove, I would call. KZH getting going, putting my direct left is not great. Good time to flop a set. Evening, ladies and gents. Doing good, I see. Hope you and Lex end up on the final table. That would be quite something if myself and Lex end up on the final table, but I would love nothing more for it to be myself, Lex and Sprague marching in together, hand in hand, side by side. About time for Nat and I. Thanks for good laughs and entertainment. Night Finty and good luck. Sorry, Fintan, excuse me. Thank you so much, mate. Appreciate you dropping in. Miss you on that. And uh, Finty should get some stuff. Jack 10 is good, Limitless. Hopefully he falls. I would love to get that bounty. Would not say no to a nine. We're going to over about the turn. I could be convinced to check here. Well, we're going to be all in on the river. Please do not have Queen X of Hearts or 8X of Hearts. That would be pretty vile. I've showered Limitless once before on the final table of the 5k. Can we please shower him on the 10k as well? A little check call from the Ace Queen. Oh my god, that was amazingly disgusting. Oh my god. Ooh, I'll have a little soap of me tea for that one. And I'm not entirely sure if I meant to call, but because I'm not, and because we're very deep stacked, I am just gonna fold. Like it's a dangler. If I had like ace eight, ace nine, I would call, but I'm just gonna fold this one. It could be wrong, but I it's a very expensive mistake I could potentially be compounding, right? Got a mix between call and true bed here, and this time I'm going to re-raise versus Mr. Belthouse. Is the 10k still late, Regin? For 37 more minutes, but there won't be too many people jumping in at this point, would be my guess. I'll show my ace if he folds. <clears throat> I can't really help myself. Imagine he knocks Lex out. I mean, like, I'm not going to be sad if I knock Lex out. I'd prefer to knock other people out, but at the same time, I'm here to try and win a 10k. Like the other day when like, Sprague knocked me out of some tournament and he felt bad, like that's never me. Same way as like, I just don't feel bad when... I just, I just don't feel bad for other poker players, except for Mason Pai. Mason Pai is the exception to the rule. I would open this in the softer tournaments, but we're gonna fold here. But I do feel joy when they win, you know what I mean? So like, it's just, I just, I don't, I don't have it inside me to take on the sadness of other people, but I can, en I can enjoy the wins. Which I think is a good way to be. I think some poker players are not like that. How long is late Reg left? Um, I think it's 30 minutes is what we just said, right? Oh my god. We have the aces. The aces are good. The aces are really, really good. Yo, Finty, you drink later one beer for that sexy river? Uh, nope. I'm just going to min-raise because I've been min-raising all the time, but I do think I should raise bigger here with these stacks. Just going to be honest. <clears throat> that dude knows your ATB. <laughs> um, at this stack depth... 
we are still just going to call, I think. Hopefully they have kings and just put all the ships in. That would be cool. We are not going to be doing any folding, chat. Say check, we are going to be betting half what? I am now up about 15 grand because of these bounties. I was even before today. Hopefully we are going to be winning all of these chips. If M. Arthur shows the turn, we call. Please do not have kings, mate. Please do not have kings. That would be disgusting. I don't think they would check kings on the turn. I don't think they would, but I am wagering all the chips. Oh, what a sick runner. Ah, oh, what a sick runner. Ooh. All right. I mean, I think their turn bet is going to be bet sometimes. Going to be check sometimes. Unlucky though. Alright, we still have 52 big blinds. It changes the situation a lot because now people will actually be getting to hunt me. But, oh, all good. <clears throat> Whoops! Ah, that's a big one to get wrong. Basically, I thought they were about to flop with King Queen a lot. I thought they were about to flop with Queen 10 a lot. They obviously blocked it a lot as well. Um, I just didn't think that they were going to have anything other than the Queen there, but I got it wrong. Bad couple of moments for the lads. Nobody bluffs, so I should have just folded. Just taken my L. Lex is calling for the bounty. I would have called if I had position to call. Obviously, I can't call from where I was, though. If this falls to me and pads shoves over and open, I would be calling. I'm ready to give him the tissues. I'm ready for it. Go on, Patrick. In it goes. King Jack. Does, KZ, does KZH fold? I'm ready to send you to the showers. Put this in your blog, mate. <laughs> Easy. See you later, mate. No, 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 no. See you later, pads. I hope I feature in the vlog. Last time for the break. We're back in the game. We were never out of the game. Look at that. Eighteen thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars in bounties. Take a look at my fat stack. All right, boys and girls, having a bit of buzz. Seventy-seven big blinds. We won't get upset about some about some mishaps. I think the ace is a standard, but I'll look at it because it was a big pot later on. And uh, I'm going to take a very quick break. That is cool. Two pairs cool, but this is outrageous. We have aces. Oh my god, Pads is back in. Can we get it again? Could we, could we get it again? Could we get on the vlog twice? Could we get on the vlog two times? No. Don't walk me, man. Please no walking. Uh, we're gonna check. Unfortunately, they folded in the spot where we aces. And Spraggles joins our table. What a table! Spraggy, Lex, and myself. Unbelievable scenes. Uh, we're just gonna be check folding. How do we double to the milli? Uh, I got some chips off pads. Spraggy and Lex, two for one special incoming. Dude, if, if I won a pot where I knocked out Spraggy and Lex for a combined total of five thousand dollars plus, what is it, six thousand two hundred fifty dollars? I don't, I don't know, I don't know if I'd be able to handle that. That might be a little bit too much for me to handle. Like Spraggy and Finton on the same table. What is this? A crossover episode? <laughs> Spraggles is all in, isn't he? Back up to almost one million chips. If this falls to me, I will have a raise. And here against Patrick, there's definitely going to be some big betting on this board. I'm going to actually big bet this hand. Slightly big. Mm, sure. Not entirely sure about this. Alright, now this time, final two tables of the night. We have a Benj versus Spraggles pot going down here. Triples is going to be good for Lex. <clears throat> Gex says, do you ever sleep? Mate, I slept for 10 hours last night. Like, legit. Very sad to have to follow Jack and I suited here, but I don't really see what else we can do. Forever says, there's a life motto that serves me well. You sleep in a fucker every goddamn night. Buy one every 10 years or so. Yeah, it's like I never invested in a good chair. Now, obviously, you will laugh because this is not the one, but I did just buy a Herman Miller. That cost a couple of grand, I think, or maybe 1500 I'm not sure, but uh, I feel like uh, my back will be well served by it. And I got, I got these, I went into them, into the Harvey Norman, and I said, which ones will make me feel like I'm sleeping in a hotel? That's what I want in my life. And we got them, and they're unbelievable. 
$11,236 confirmed to Minkash. Obviously, we are already free rolling this tournament. First off, PokerStars put it in, put me into the tournament, so I didn't pay anything. So that is $18,000 in pure profit, which is pretty cool, which means that I'm pretty sure at this point it will now be impossible for me to have a losing double cube. And I will just use this $18,000 for the next uh, four or five days to blast it off and uh, hopefully become a mad... A mad? Become a mad? Become a champion! All right, we have a very pretty looking eight nine suited. We are going to attempt to see a flop. Hope that there's lots of red cards and middling cards. Ah, can't call with eight nine suited here. In the bin it goes. Jack's rip. Wow, that is aggressive. Save me. Ooh, definitely save me. All right, we're down to 26 players. If we lose half the field, we're in the money. Oh, best advice, get lessons. You'll see so much improvement on better hitting the beauty of a golf shot. I am going to get lessons after W cube. It's a small blind, we're just going to call. If Lex has a seven or a deuce, he is going to stack me here. I'm not going to be folding kings on that turn when like eight, nine, jack, nine, jack, eight. These kind of fans are going to be betting. It doesn't feel great, but... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, a seven or a king would make things very straightforward. If Lex takes my bounty, I told him to celebrate, but I'm not here to fold kings. If we are out, it could not go to a better man, and I wish him the best of luck. But I am not here to fold the Kevin Cleans. GG. There's nothing I can do. He better celebrated! If he didn't celebrate, I'm going to be fuming. But nice hand. I don't think I can fold kings there, even though I do think Lex is going to have it a lot. Um just how the game works. You have 35 big blinds, you flop an over pair. Sometimes you're gonna lose. GG's. What a monster bounty for him. Will I watch it live and see if he's celebrated? Right, uh, fits in hands. Please, chats. <sighs> oh my god, it's beautiful. Please have something, please have something. Fucking 12k bounty. $12,000. My heart's beating on my chest. Holy shit, yes. Holy fuck! Holy shit, GG Finton always fucking sucks, but I promised him, he sent me literally, he said me, don't be, he sent to me, don't be a twat and not celebrate when you win my bounty, so I'm, I'm gonna pay homage to his memory, but holy shit, that feels so fucking good. I just won 12k in bounties. Oh, mate, I'm so happy. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, 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 okay. Beggars can't be choosers. I was laughing at my bounty now, huh?